Mark Barnett at home on Saturday. Your thoughts ahead of the game? Well, similar thoughts, Henry, as we always know. Um, similar question as well. I thought we might have had a different one today. But um, no, our, our thoughts immediately turn to, to Barnett, in which will be a very difficult game. Um, a lot of attacking threat. Um, they probably haven't had a couple of results as they would like lately, so they're going to they're going to be a wounded animal, which you always know will be a dangerous animal. And knowing their manager well, he's a real tough competitor, and he'll, he'll have them right fired up for this. So, um, yeah, uh, another real tough challenge awaits, but one we're looking to meet head on, one we're very much looking forward to, one we've worked hard for in uh, in training this week, and we've had a good week's training. And um, like I said, we're getting. We're getting there now, some more competition for places and uh, like I said, we're, we're looking forward to the game. You spoke on last week being an important week and obviously four points from that week. It's you know, a great return. How do you reflect on it? Um, so I think two clean sheets. So I think it was actually five points, two draws and a, and a win, if my memory serves me right. But I don't. Often, I might be wrong because I don't look back too often. I'm only looking ahead. But uh, yeah, two, I think two clean sheets was obviously um, a, a real positive. Um, very unfortunate having led for so long in the other game as well. So um, you know, could it could have been better? Could have been a lot worse. But it's certainly given us a strong platform to build on. And like I said really, really pleased with the boys and their application. And their, like I said we we can celebrate a lot in the, in those games. A lot a lot of positives. But again, there's there's always room for improvement and. Uh, been trying to refine and, and, and get better as we always do every week. Of course, some boys still recovering from injury. Some boys, you know, still maybe out with a knock. What's the latest on all of them? I'm starting to see um, everyone really out on the training pitch at the moment. Um, Kev Locko's joined in training today, which is a real big positive and a real big lift for everyone around the around the club as well. Um, still a, a long way away, but um, great to have him in back in and around the group. Um, he's, you know, like I said he's a, a real big presence around around the group, and he's someone who's who's been missed. So it's been it's been great to have him back in around the group, and um, yeah, everyone else is is fighting fit, and uh, you know, looking looking to put on that shirt. Of last time we played Barnet, it was on BT Sport Live on telly. Bit of a difference since then. What do you think's changed, and how do you reflect on that time since you've been there? Uh, I think um, a lot's changed, and I think. I hope a lot of change since then because you know if, if it hasn't, then we're we're not improving and we're very small steps. But I feel we're always going in the right direction. There's been uh, trials and tribulations since then. It was a, a difficult night that night, a real sucker punch at the end, a, a great strike from them, um, and, and we were very unfortunate not to get something out of that game. But certainly, you know, looking for revenge in this game and and to put put things right. But um, yeah, I think we've we've been on a on a journey already. I think we're learning very quickly, everyone. And I said, I think the the group is um, a real together group at the moment. And when we look back at nights like that and those hardships is why we probably stand strong at the moment. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information. Click here for the next video. Click here to subscribe.